Yeah, so we're gonna start off with Losers Finals. We got Denji versus Dakpo. Yeah, I appreciate you guys tuning in to Attorney uh, Locator. And to finish Three, beyond, this is the 17 two, one. Oh, is Denji really go. good? Yeah. And he's been on the melee grind, so. Wow, that laser, I like when it deflects this stranger. Oh, yeah. So, uh, neither players hit each other. There we go. We got a hit. Two hits. Three. Oh, no, not three hits. Yeah, I think well, that's a, a pretty good idea for Denti. He's been doing some really good things with the Jigglypuff, and as soon as it... Yeah, as soon as it, He didn't even need the forward air if he just rolled back. And that's exactly what it's going to. As soon as uh, Falco gets off stage, I, I mean, it's going to be hard for him to get back on stage. Yeah. As is, but then with an opponent like Dak, I'm sorry, like uh, Denti, and with a character that has as much maneuverability as Jigglypuff, it's going to be really, really, really difficult for him to regain his uh, position on stage. Uh, what what I would like to see Dakpo do is up smash. Uh, because uh, yeah, let's kill him with that. Sorry. Yeah, it, the up B on Falco is actually pretty powerful. That's how you see people kill off the top with like the shine to up B. I don't know if you watch that. Uh, yeah, the shine, absolutely. Oh, Good pivot forward smash to catch him forward airing. I like that. Smart. It's right. amazing how much thought. Oh, oh rest wow. Oh my God. Yeah, let's see what Dakpo can do. Yeah, 19% weak punish. I think down air to shine to something does more than that. Yeah, you may be right about that. Yeah, had, uh, had Denti gotten that kill off the top, we would have been able to uh, yeah. take no damage, but killed off the side. We still pops Denti for that kill. I think all of us enjoy when Jigglypuff gets that rest in regardless of who's playing Jigglypuff. Oh, oh my gosh! It doesn't work. Just don't hold <coughs> neutral. Uh, this matchup is pretty even, but uh, Jigglypuff punishes a lot harder. Wow. Ooh, good back here. Wow, great forward smash. Hands off my prey. Oh wow. Hands off my prey. Wow. Oh my god, Dak. I remember in the melee boards, uh, Jigglypuff was considered to be really bad for a long time, and then Mango won Genesis. And so then people were like, we need to know how to beat Jigglypuff. So then there was a thread on the boards about like, what character had like the best punish for every character. Like Fox was lasers to uh, like up smash, she's the safest one. The best punish is lasers to drill, grab, up throw up air. Doesn't always work. Oh. Good grab. Falcos should be late down air to shine. No to, uh, like, you can start a combo. Like you yeah. can down air. So basically, let you guys know this. I think I was. I can't remember which which tournament it was at. I think I was watching Armada. And he was going Toon Link. I think he was going versus Hungry Box. Hungry Box was playing Jigglypuff. I want to say. And the combo that he did after Jigglypuff missed her rest it was like. So full of like boomerangs and bombs and grabs. Oh, like, yeah, you uh, three, the, the easiest two, one to do with juggling is you throw the boomerang past them, exactly. and as it's coming back, you can hit with both hits of the force. But you can also, what he probably did was like throw a bomb up, yeah, into the mix. Yeah, it was so crazy, like, yeah, it was it was just ridiculous. And I was like, how did he, how did he even know that? Like, yeah, like, I mean, that's something that's one of those things about being prepared in uh, in melee. He, Peach has two. You throw the turnip up. You either you throw the turnip up, and then you let it like fall, uh -huh. and you can down smash, and then like the turnip will hit them back into your down smash. Oh, this is the Or the turnip will hit them into your sweet spot up smash, which is one of the strongest moves in the game. Peach. Yeah, man. Yeah, that's crazy. It's really difficult to land. Yes. Yeah. Oh my god! Every hit of the forward air. Yeah, the shout outs to the crazy legs. Also, uh, no shout outs to uh, the Flutterhouse because it's a terrible name and the crazy legs is the best name. Speaking of shout outs, I gotta give a shout out to Denti for taking the momentum from game one, switching back to Ivor, which has or seems to have some trouble versus the Falco in this matchup, but he, man, he's doing his thing. Putting it yeah, work I think he this. wants to just keep his Ivor warm because he. Like with a with a win like that, it's pretty clear. Like Dakpo doesn't know what to do. There's not a big chance of Dakpo being on this set, so he's already in his mind probably preparing for a set with Seth one. Yeah, 
I don't want to see Daniel give up though. Like that was something that I'm not oh, saying I'm not knocking. Yeah, I absolutely don't think he will. But it just seemed as if in your match, for example, in Rasmus, when he was great. fighting your Johnny Cross, there was a moment when you got his head and just absolutely took the over the entire game. Like well, from after you took the first shot, the whole game was it seemed like it was over. You know, and so I know he's not giving up. But well, yeah, I mean. It's just, it's just not yeah, the best well, game usually, that I've usually seen to do moment. something like that, you have to predict something really hard. And, and for Dagpo specifically, like, he takes pride in predictions. So yeah. If somebody, you know, has a better day, predicts better than he does, it's not, not a good feeling. Yeah. It's not a good feeling when he does it to me either. Sometimes it's hard to mentally come back to that. Absolutely. Oh, wow. Oh, no, he's got it. Okay, okay. Great recovery yeah. from uh, Denti. Yeah. Meteor cancels at the right time. And then to double jump, then down air. To position himself for the up in the middle round. Very impressive situation awareness. Shout out to Dak, though. You, you really need to be, stay calm for situations like that. Yeah, absolutely. And it happens so quickly, you know what I mean? Like, Great bait on that spot, though. Oh, uh, nice. I like that. I like that. No. Oh, oh gives him that quick slap. Yeah. <laughs> That move is so strong. Is that one of the, that has to be one of the, the strongest up airs we've got? Up air? Yeah. Uh, it, or, I think it's the up smash in the sweet spot. They're both pretty strong. I don't strong. know. They're really strong. What is sweet spots? I mean, Lucas up smash. Oh, well, yeah, game, Joe. Lucas, Game & Watch has higher base knock back. Uh, but I, it's like the, about the same Game & Watch as Lucas is up smash. Sure, well, are you talking about Lucas is fully charged? Wow! Nice, that's stopped. Yeah. That was insane. Man, Denti is going to work right now. Yep, he's got his briefcase. And his monster. his thermos and coffee. Is that coffee though? It's a monster? No, I just fi figuratively, like, he's a businessman. Like, he's wearing a Rolex watch and check. He's like, oh, can't be late for work. He's got his briefcase, you know? I like it. He gets in his, uh, gets in his car. He gets on the, the freeway. Yeah, I like it. Going to work. Oh, Three, this, this looks two, like it's going to be a one, just go! Lasers from the deck, though, because it broke. Yeah. What's up? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we, we are going to be here for a while, so... Uh, Might have saved him. Oh, nope. Deck Poe's running. Run away, deck Poe. Don't down air in the air. Dente all over this man like, I don't know, peanut butter on peanut butter, peanut butter on a peanut butter sandwich. Exactly. He is, he will not let him run away like. That was like the laziest uh, simile. Exactly. Peanut butter on a like, peanut butter exactly. sandwich. Exactly. We're there. emphasizing that's how he's on there. Right. It's literally impossible to have a peanut butter sandwich without peanut butter. Right. And you know when the peanut butter's on there, it is on there. Yeah, I mean, it's on. Like, it's not coming off. Oh! Wow, sick the read, read and the timing to make that happen. I like it. I like it. Oh, the reverse grab. Okay. Okay. Oh, I see you, Dak. Oh, I like Ooh, Look at this. I don't know what about that last week. It hits so often. It's so frequent. Every time Dak jabs as that, it just hits. Oh, well, I mean, the double shot didn't really accomplish anything, but it was still cool. It was cool. It sounded cool. I think it was his second hit that pops him up, so... I like that. The pressure? Oh. Dude double shines, but... Forgets to jump out of that shine. Sick grab from Oh, That's no! Yep. That is... Wow. All you need That's is one unreal. read off stage. That is so impressive. Okay, I'm not really sure how that happened, but... Wow, that's, like, that covers so many options. The Razor Leaf to slow pulling up the tether, like, there's just not much you can do. Wow, I'm just so tired. I, I know, me I too. Can't I, like, think. We both zone we out. We see Ivysaur Ivy and the Falco, they're doing the uh, animal thing. And this rain doesn't uh, doesn't help at all. Oh yeah, how is he gonna charge solar beam in the rain? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Solar beam doesn't do. Uh, I think no, it, solar beam still works in the rain in Pokemon. I think it actually does like half damage. Or something. <laughs> 
Oh, that is the Oracle. But Synthesis, is, uh, Synthesis does like a quarter of the normal healing in the rain of Pokemon. Oh man, that Dragon Ball Z moment. Grab. There we oh, go. Oh, I like it, I like it. See, Denti could see that Dakpo was trying to, uh... Dakpo was not ready for the grab, so he grabbed him right in between the jabs. Oh, man. Oh, my God. I am feeling it. Wow, I great like read from Dakpo. Just a weird sour spot that kills off the top. Dude, this rain's gonna put me to sleep. I promise you. Is this yes. stage is too peaceful. Yeah, it's just we need some dubstep. So lulling, it's like angry. It's just lulling me to sleep with the soft music and the rain. I'm not. I'm. I'm not gonna lie. I'm looking at the background right now. I'm yeah. looking at the ball board. <laughs> yeah, I was doing that earlier in the match. Let's watch the little credits. What's up? Oh, it's been pretty close, but Dakpo popping off. I know that's a misuse of the expression, but. Yeah. When I say it, I mean he's going in right now. See, he's pop that's popping on. Popping on, okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll say popping on. Popping on. Type of popping on right now. Ooh, look at that. What? Clapping that Heine. He's getting popped on right now. Yeah, Heine. Heine has been clapped. Clap. Oh, and are in the process of being clapped. Oh, the, yeah. Oh. They're not done. Why did he go for the downer there instead of the backer? I think the backer might have... Maybe, but it would have been harder to land the uh, sweet spot. That's it, that's it. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, that's it. Great that's it. To shift that momentum. I like Denti. it. And now we got Grand Final. 